What's up, YouTube? Going, coming back at you with another light review. We have something pretty cool and unique here. This is from Xtar. They sent me a, a light recently to review. But this is called the Moon. And this is um, a hands-free rechargeable LED light is the best way they describe it. You can see here in the picture, this is totally how I picture using it, how it's clipped to that backpack strap. And they're kind of just using it as a um, hands-free light, kind of like a headlamp, but not on your head. Great use for that. You have lots of different um, uses of this. Let's go over the basic specs. Your high mode is 120 lumens, and you're going to get that uh, 4.2 hours on that. Mid is 60 lumens, low is 30, moonlight is 3, and strobe is, is 120 as well. Um, 15 meter beam throw, it's not meant to throw. It's definitely more flood, and it is I, uh, impact resistant to 1.5 meters, waterproof to IPX6 standards. It uses a Samsung LED, which is a little bit different. And what's cool is there's a built-in 22 milliamp battery in this to recharge it. Right here on the side, and it comes with a little charger. You can recharge that on micro USB. And I could totally see this being a very useful little light in so many different ways, especially if when you're out camping. Um, you could clip this on your backpack so it shows on the... Um, you can see it just lights up like that. You could use this um, on your on your backpack, um, in your tent as like a little like almost a lantern. Clip it somewhere, give you some light. You could just to show you the different modes. And we'll do some beam shots outside as well. But uh, another application that I actually thought of that I really like this for is a safe, a light for your gun safe. You can clip this on your top. It's got a nice strong clip that has a lot of give. Let me look how wide it can go. And you can clip that on the top shelf of your um, gun safe. And then when you come in, just press that button and bam, you've got a lights up your gun safe. It's going to be brighter than most of those lights are going to be. So that's another cool um, use for the moon. Just a cool little um, light. It's it's definitely different. It looks funky. It looks different. Um, it's, it's just a cool little personal light uh, for camping, for all those other uses we um, talked about. So let's do some beam shots and we'll kind of wrap up the video. All right, we're out here with the X-Tar Moon. Here's your low mode. I'm kind of just holding the light up right now. Here's your medium. It's got a ton of very wide beam. Which you're not probably seeing as much. Medium. That's high, actually. That's your high, and if you hold down the button, it goes into strobe. And then the next it just turns it off, so it's got those modes, three modes. That's high. High. Medium. Low. Which is like basically like a moonlight. Which would be a good... I can't really see it. Let's see. The camera doesn't pick it up well. So a good like way to identify yourself and not to blind someone, to see what's going on in front of you, you know, if you're camping or whatever. And if you need to go brighter, you can. It's pretty cool little light. On, on high, it's pretty bright. Lights things up pretty well. The extra moon on high inside. All right, guys, so I really like this little guy, the Moon RC2. Very cool, rechargeable light, um, lots of different uses. This is definitely going to my camping gear, I think. Um, or even, I may even just throw it in my gun safe and use it as my gun safe light. And because it's rechargeable, I don't have to keep replacing batteries, so if it dies on me, I'm having a hard time getting that back in there, um, I can just recharge it, and bam, I don't have to go out and buy any batteries for my safe light. So... I, I can't decide I might pick one up for my safe and use it for that and then use this other one for camping. But I could see a lot of a lot of uses out of this really, really cool little light, guys. So thanks for watching the video on the on the X-Tar Moon. Um, any questions or comments, leave them down below. And we'll see you in the next video.